So hi guys, welcome back. Um, today I'm gonna show you guys a procedure of uh, uh, binding this uh, AT9 to its to its uh, receiver. Um, should be a simple process. The manual says that you should connect your power source to uh, channel three, which I'm gonna do right now. So there we go. Now you have a bind binding button over here uh, you, that you can press with the with a small screwdriver first of all you should turn on your radio so let's turn on our AT9 let's press the button and power your receiver the LED will blink and as soon as you have a solid LED it should be bound so that's it done let's bring out a servo to test this uh, connect this to channel one right here here we go and there you go uh, let me show you guys there you go very nice good resolution the servo moves very very smoothly um, yeah done so quite easy uh, this uh, this servo also has an S bus mode uh, that I'm gonna show you guys now how to get an S bus um, if you if you press this like a mouse twice the binding button it will light up a purple uh, LED and this means that you're now in S bus mode so this port over here, the nine, the nine, the ninth channel, um, is now S bus channel. So you will have ten channels on S bus. Cool, awesome. Um, and then double click back to traditional to normal mode. So that's it. Um, quite easy. It works good. Um, so this was the process of binding that the radio link at9 to its r9d receiver so thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you next time bye bye